Hey, Bruce, clearly you're not used to being shut out. Um, you lost your you know, two top receivers and your leading running back. How much was that a part of the story or really hadn't scored before they went out? Yeah, it was big. You know, obviously the young guys, I was hoping they'd step up a little bit more than the receivers. And um, overall, we just dropped too many balls, too. I mean, when we did have some some guys open and uh, they did a good job playing. You know, they played that hard man to man and, and we did not do a very good job of getting open. Thanks. Next question will come from Greg Allman. The line of scrimmage, just what their defensive line did to, to pressure Brady. I think they got to him for four sacks and kind of start things there. Yeah, it's all coverage, you know. I mean, we like to get the ball out of our hand quickly. They got they play that tight man and uh, two deep safeties and, you know, took some of those away and, and made us hold the ball. Bruce, you, get, you guys had, had put a lot in, in wanting to be able to win a, dis, a division title on your home field. How much does it hurt? You, you guys are going to win this division at some point, but how much does it hurt not to have that? It hurts more losing all the players we lost. We lost about seven starters in this game, so I'm, I'm more concerned about that right now. Thank you. Lord Jenna Lane. Hey, Coach, along those lines, do you have an update on any of these players with the injuries, Mike, Chris, Lenny, Levante? Uh, no, uh, two or three hamstrings. Obviously, Chris's knee, Levante's foot, uh, Leonard's a hamstring. So we'll wait and see. And, Coach, just before the game, Jason Light said on the Buccaneers radio network that Mike Edwards and Antonio Brown will be rejoining the team next week. Um, can you just speak to what went into that decision to bring both players back? No, yeah, it's in the best interest of our football team. And uh, both those guys have served their time, and uh, we welcome them back. Thank you. Mm -hmm. We'll go to Scott Reynolds. If any media have a question, please raise your hand. Bruce, you guys struggled in some short yardage situations. On a third and two, there's a deep shot uh, to Jalen Darden that's incomplete. The fourth and one, it's it's a deep shot to Gronk that's incomplete. Uh, Keyshawn Vaughn failed to get a yard on, on third and one. Can you explain the, the rationale in, in taking such deep shots for those first two I mentioned when you needed uh, one yeah, or two? Yeah, I yards? think it was just the man to man who was single covered. And, they, you know, I'll take that Gronk, that Gronk matchup most times and, uh, you know, um, whether he was interfered with or not. But, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll still take that matchup. Thank you, Bruce. We'll go to Kevin O'Donnell. Hey, Bruce, uh, obviously the defense played well enough to keep uh, New Orleans out of the end zone. How disappointing is it that, that your offense just could not uh, find any, anything to, to put any points on the board? Yeah, it's very, very, very disappointing. It's never happened to me. I don't know. I can't remember last time I shut out and uh, or us. And uh, but our kicking game, our kickers let us down. Also, I mean, this is between the offense and the, and the kicking game. It cost us the game. The defense played good enough to win. We'll go back to Greg. Bruce, the, the best spark you had offensively was was Ronald had the two runs, like a ten yard run, then a thirty two yard run. And then he came off the field. I think it was two misses with Keyshawn. How much did that hurt having to take him out for whatever reason and, and kind of losing the momentum he had there? Yeah, it's just a matter of him getting gassed real quick and uh, and getting Keyshawn in for a couple of pass plays. Thanks, Bruce. We'll go back to John Lair. Hey, Coach, I know you mentioned the injuries. Do you have any indication on the severity of any of those? No. Okay, thank you. We'll go to Sabi Dean. Coach, I know obviously the timing of all these injuries with three games left here is not ideal. How do you just try to approach the final stretch here with these injuries? Yeah, whoever's up, got to go play a little better, and uh, doesn't matter who's who's available. But we got to get we got to get ready and go beat Carolina. We have time for a few more. Next, we'll go to Joey Knight. Coach, uh, Gronk had some uncharacteristic drops. Was he okay tonight, or he just struggled? He just dropped it. Okay, thanks. We'll go to Rick Stroud. Bruce, the Saints have had your number in the regular season. Is it primarily their defense has just given you the most trouble? Yeah, there's no doubt. You know, we've, we've struggled uh, with their secondary um, a number of times now. Okay. Thanks. All right, that's all we have time for. Appreciate you time, coach. Thanks, guys.